Today, we are going to discuss care products available for use on Collins Aerospace Goodrich de-icers. Collins Aerospace offers several care products that are approved for use on Goodrich pneumatic de-icers. Some products provide protection from weathering and ozone, while others have primarily cosmetic purposes. Only Collins Aerospace Goodrich de-icing care products are approved for use on Goodrich de-icing boots. Our materials engineering team performs extensive research and testing on our products and our labs and icing wind tunnel, as well as on-wing evaluation, to ensure that they do not damage the material of the boot and allow for proper inflation and ice shed. Use of non-Goodrich products will void the warranty of the de-ice boot. Please remember that this video is for reference only. During application, proper documentation should be followed including your Aircraft Maintenance Manual and Goodrich Installation Manual 30-10-31. It is important that proper PPE practices are followed throughout the process, including wearing safety glasses and chemical-resistant gloves as required. While many de-ice boots are still made from the familiar neoprene, Collins Aerospace Goodrich is the sole manufacturer of de-icers made from S-Stain, an engineered polymer which provides improved fluid resistance and ice shedding. When maintaining the black de-icers on your aircraft, it is important to determine if they are neoprene or S-stain to ensure you use the correct products. You can find this information by checking the laser brand, located on the lower inboard edge of the de-icer. Before beginning the process, mask off application area with masking tape to protect surrounding surfaces and prevent staining. The first step in the care process is to prepare the de-icer using Shine Master Prep, which cleans the de-icer of contaminants and residual coatings. Apply Shine Master Prep to the de-icer, ensuring that the surface is fully covered. For heavy buildup, allow the Shine Master Prep to remain on the de-icer for five to seven minutes before removing. Rub de-icer with a clean, wet sponge or lint-free cloth, rinsing or swapping out the cloth as it becomes dirty or saturated. Repeat the process until all residual coating and dirt are removed. Rinse the de-icer with clean water and wipe dry with clean, lint-free cloths. Ozone causes the most de-icer damage, not UV. Age Master No. 1 is a rubber preservative that replenishes the emollients destroyed by ozone and creates a barrier to protect against ozone and weather. After fully cleaning the de-icer with Shine Master Prep to remove any residual substances, use a lint-free cloth to wipe three even coats of Age Master No. 1 on the de-icer surface. Make sure to coat the de-icer surface completely and evenly each time. Allow 5 to 10 minutes of dry time between each coat. To prevent staining, Age Master No. 1 requires a 24-hour dry time before flying the aircraft or applying any other products. Shine Master is a cosmetic coating that provides a high luster shine. It can be applied over Age Master No. 1 or to the bare rubber which has been cleaned with Shine Master Prep. Using a clean lint-free cloth, Wipe in one direction to apply a light, even coat. Shine Master should not be heavily applied, as it can appear cracked if buildup becomes too thick. When more product is needed, lift the cloth slowly to prevent bubbles from forming on the surface. Allow it to dry to touch, about 5 to 15 minutes between coats. Two to three coats are recommended to get desired shine. Collins Goodrich Aerospace Protectant is a cosmetic treatment that provides resistance to dust, soiling, and staining. It also provides nearly 100% prevention of UV-caused slow fade. It is designed for frequent use and can be applied as needed. No surface stripping is required. Shake the protectant before use. Spray onto a clean, lint-free cloth, saturating the cloth. Additionally, spray directly onto the de-icer. Ensure the cloth stays wet throughout the process. Using medium hand pressure, wipe the de-icer to apply a uniform coat. Lightly hand buff the de-icer with a clean lint-free cloth to desired gloss. 
IceX2 is an ice inhibitor that enhances de-icer performance. It lowers the adhesion strength between the ice and de-icer surface, allowing ice to shed more easily. Using a clean cloth or pad, apply a light coat of IceX2 by wiping in a single, continuous motion down the length of the de-icer. Do not apply IceX2 too heavily as this can result in a sticky surface that collects dust and dirt and reduces the effectiveness of the product. IceX2 can be applied every 50 flight hours during icing season, or as desired. If other Collins Goodrich products are used, IceX2 should be the last product applied. Regular cleaning is key to preventing performance marks from bugs, dirt, and grime. Collins Goodrich Aerospace Cleaner is a water-based formula that can be used to clean any de-icer as needed. Shake the cleaner before use. Spray onto a clean, lint-free cloth, saturating the cloth. Additionally, spray directly onto the de-icer. Ensure the cloth stays wet throughout the process. For more difficult areas, allow the cleaner to soak for 30 to 90 seconds. Wipe down the de-icer with medium hand pressure to remove dirt and debris. Repeat as needed. All of the care products discussed today are approved for use on Collins Aerospace Goodrich Black Neoprene de-icers. It is important that Age Master No. 1 is not applied to Estain or Silverboot de-icers. The remainder of the products are approved for use on Estain and Silverboot. While physical damage to pneumatic de-ice boots can happen at any time, regular maintenance using Collins Aerospace Goodrich de-icing care products can delay most age-related deterioration, maximizing longevity and effectiveness. If you have any questions throughout this process, please do not hesitate to contact Collins Aerospace Product Support.